War always carries a cost, and my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, I can't save everyone. In order to maintain my cover with the Pact, I had to sacrifice Selena. I just hope I can explain myself to her one day. But first, I have to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from stealing a deadly virus. With it, they could carry out mass murder in Gotham on a scale the city has never seen. Just gotta take out one itty bitty god. Then we can get the rest of the gang inside. Time to paint this place red, Brucey boy. No, let me handle this. <clears throat> Can I help you? Uh, we're here for a massage. Couples massage? Nothing too vigorous. We need to save our energy for, uh, other activities. Sorry, looks like we're all booked up. You'll need to return some other time. Maybe call ahead first. We're very busy, so you'll need to be leaving now. Not bad, Bruce. I give you an A for effort, but a C for style. Loren, you losers gonna join the party or what? You run into trouble. <laughs> Nothing we couldn't handle. Be ready. More will come. He's always so serious. Be on the lookout for security measures. We can disable them from here. Nicely done, Brucie. Come on. The clock is ticking. Jeez. Lots of doors. Hey, should we, uh, just start opening them? Secret lab? Hey! <laughs> Not that one. Hey, hey, you shouldn't be here. Hold up. I think this is it. Then that's where we want to go. What is this? Watch closely. Oh, good. I could use a little color. The dear departed Riddler's gonna help us out. Very clever. Come on, we're taking a ride. Just so we're all clear, this is a smash and grab operation. We smash the lab, grab the virus, and then we're gone. A virus? Sounds... Dangerous and unpredictable. If used properly, it should allow me to cure my Nora. And I will be able to perfect the power of my venom. The virus can do all that? <laughs> this is so exciting. The moment we've all been waiting for. Ooh, we gotta get this one for the history books. <sighs> Make sure you get my good side. Okay, everybody. Say cheese. Come on! Squeeze in! Ooh. It's... it's perfect! Is it dusty in here, or is it just me? Hey, mister! 
Which way to all your most dangerous toys? <laughs> Someone's being a bad boy. Don't. Don't give her a reason. So boring. Chop, chop, boys. It's the last mile. Waller, I'm in. Good. We're on our way. Do not let the pack get their hands on that virus, Bruce. I've got it under control. Talking to yourself, huh? John. It's, it's okay, Bruce. I talk to myself all the time. To be honest, my voices haven't been letting up lately either. I, I keep thinking this virus was the thing holding us all together. It's what made us stick. I, I don't know. Call me paranoid, but I'm worried once it's gone, Harley's just gonna just disappear. I just don't think I could take that kind of rejection. Have you thought about sabotaging their plan? I have, but I wouldn't even know where to start. I got an idea. What if you help me do it? You're, you're a smart guy, after all. All right, I'm in. I'll think of something. Yeah, I knew I could count on you, Bruce. We're together, through thick and thin. Come on, buddy. We don't want to get left behind. All right, John. Plug in the drive. According to Riddler's plan, we just gotta upload this little program into their system. Oh, man. I can't seem to figure this out. <laughs> Seriously, Puds? All I asked you to do was be the tech guy. Congratulations! You're hired! Now let's get this show on the road. And presto, changeo. Whoa! Was that the expected result? Hang on, would ya? Now that's what Mama wanted to see. Hang on to that, Brucey. I can't afford any more mishaps. All right, let's get moving. The lab is this way. The enemy! Dead ahead! <laughs> if these fools want to fight, I am more than happy to oblige. Heads up, fellas! You would be wise to get out of our way. Stand in my way again, or you will take his place. Damn it. What the? No, you don't. Rod's fire. I'll do the rest. No time to sit on your thumbs, boys. Move it! Nice moves, buddy. Faith, up ahead. Don't let the barrier close. Now. This is it. Crack it open, Bruce.
initiated emergency protocol, we'll be incinerated. I would advise you all to get down on the floor. Should have brought my scarf. Bruce, get the door. before I can destroy the virus. Yeah. 
Yes! I've done it. I did it, Nora. Anymore. Harley! Wait up! Bye bye, Brucie. Harley! No! <laughs> Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley's escaped with the virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bioscans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Bruce. Well, you managed to stay close to them until the end, I'll give you that. But with Doe still loose in Gotham, and the Lotus virus in the hands of a psychopath, I'm not sure good is the word I'd use to describe what happened here. Oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. It was up to your people to catch them. Or were you just running late again? Both of you, please. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just... evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. This facility needs to be razed to the ground. I don't want so much as a trace of it left in my city. Why don't you let me worry about that, Wayne? Bruce, you need to get after Quinn and quick. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> Don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. Was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. Waller was out of line. She should know to trust your instincts. Usually she does. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. Us. It couldn't possibly have been money. I failed to see what you have to gain. You need to be stopped. It's as simple as that, Victor. You don't fool me. 
You're Wallace, lapdog, and we both know it. From where I'm standing, it's Harley who betrayed you. She abandoned you, Victor. All of you. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. The Agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. Give me the chance. I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're telling me that when Riddler worked here, he became infected with the Lotus virus? If he could survive it, I believe I can too. That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. <laughs> You want to know where Harley is? You'll keep me from being Waller's test subject. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. If that's what you want, I can do that for you, Victor. Tell me everything. Thank you, Wayne. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is... The Lotus Virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the Agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. Now, she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She will destroy anything that gets in her way. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised. subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? She can't keep secrets from me. I always get to the truth. <laughs> I have no doubt. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. You probably shouldn't suit up for this. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. Suit up? Damn it. You don't know that I told Waller you were Batman, do you? Really? Are, are we... Are we all good? It's just... We never talked about it. I'd like to clear the air. Yeah, we're good. Whew. All right, then. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. 
Harley? No. Director Waller. You say she can't keep secrets from you. I never thought she'd have reason to keep them from me. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila. Batmobile. That's incredible. If you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah. yeah Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. Just curious. I've done what I had to do. I don't always enjoy it, but it's part of being... Batman. If I don't question it, I'm as bad as the criminals I fight. That makes sense. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah, it's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. You should trust your instincts. They're what make you good at your job. I'm glad to hear you say that. It bothered me when she allowed the pact to obtain Riddler's body. Wait, that was intentional? I've had deep reservations about Waller. <sighs> Can't believe I just said that out loud. But you told her I was Batman. Bruce. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants this serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. against the wall. If she has Riddler's blood, she'll be incredibly dangerous. You don't need to tell me. Then we're on the same page. <sighs> I knew she'd be able to do it. Who? And do what? Catwoman. They threw her in this murder box before we left. Think she's still around? No. She's a runner. I doubt we'll be hearing from her anytime soon. Harley. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. this here before? Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. Damn it. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. So... Keep looking. C4. Plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something... bigger. 
I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Wonder if whoever took the vials also made a bomb. C4 certainly doesn't sound like the agency. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. C4 doesn't seem like agency issue. No, but with Waller these days, who knows? supposed to preserve him obviously it failed right decomposition is actually accelerated they purposefully disabled the capsule if that's the case then they were trying to destroy the body it's textbook asset denial but it's some sloppy work they were moving fast too fast If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh my. This may take a bit of time. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus. Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> She's a friend, John. Our friend. I had a friend. It didn't work out. Oh, hey! Hold on. Are you two-timing cat lady, Bruce? <clears throat> she was here. Wait, she was here? Yeah. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just be yourself, John. And then you convinced me! Sabotage our whole operation. And for what? 
She flew the coop! <laughs> I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn, every bad piece of advice, everything blew up in my face. This isn't my fault. Harley betrayed us, both of us. Yeah, but you weren't in love with her. There's no point. It's over. The pact, the dream, us. Not yet, it's not. She's still out there with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you. No matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. Certainly not for Gotham. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Okay, buddy. Look, the agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here. In a very dark place. They didn't find me. But Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. She gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. You need closure, John. Face to face. Nothing else is going to make you feel better. I promise you that. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. You gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no, you won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is, I need to do this alone. Call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. We really like your help, John. It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. Back. I'm taking over at the computer.
Please don't. Bell. Bell, can you hear me? Alfred? Oh, uh, 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 what's, what's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's, let's chat. Uh, now's the time. It won't be long. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes, what would Master Bruce think about what you've done? I don't know, he, he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. Uh, and, well, basically, that's all there is to it. First it's your hand shaking and now you're... You're passing out. We, we can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, oh, Ted. Hey, 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 be careful. Oh, oh, thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. The bioscan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. Harley's already insane, Alfred. I doubt she's worried about taking it up a notch. Yes, you're probably right. Although if she wants the serum to avoid what happened to her father, well, <laughs> it's certainly ironic. Run the simulation again, then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Ah, I already ran it several times myself. I... I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Then let's get you to a nice beach, huh? Or wherever you want to go. Ooh, the possibilities. That'll take some thinking. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. Agreed. But... Be careful. It shouldn't be a problem. I'm trusted here. I won't let Waller turn the agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. The vials have to go. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. Sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. 
Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. It's definitely concerning. Yeah, I've told you already that it's fine. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So... Bruce... Um, after our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I know you said I needed to train, but... I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. para aramid Synthetic Lining. Photo adaptive suit coloring. Full spectrum, full surround heads up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. Batman doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. I don't use a gun, because Batman doesn't kill. Okay, I get it. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds. It's a no-brainer. Of course I think about it sometimes. It'd be the easiest thing in the world. But easy doesn't make it right. Bingo. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here. John?
Dr. Quinzel. This is Harley's. Easy on me, you know? What am I gonna say to Bruce? It, it, it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self defense. I, I know it needs work! Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just. It, it's, it's not what it looks like. I, I can't explain. Why? And reserve judgment. What have you done, John? No, no, please! It's, it's, just hear me out. What happened? Is Harley here? She left, just as I got here. The agents, they came looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up! I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they wouldn't listen. They, they just wanted blood. Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm sorry. I, I always laugh. You said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Oh, really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I, I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in you can be straight with me john why wouldn't i be telling you the truth if i hadn't fought them off i'd be the one lying in a pool of blood you 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 believe me don't you because if we don't have trust what do we really have it's it's the foundation of any healthy relationship what kind of question is that of course I do. Then, then what's with all the suspicion? You're just trying to tell me what you think I want to hear. You're supposed to be on my side! I guess I'm an idiot for expecting that, aren't I? What do you mean? 
whatever this is between us, it's off balance. The goodwill only flows one way, and it isn't towards me. You've made that very clear by now. John, that's not true, okay? You're imagining things. Really? Loopy old John's hearing the voices again. Is that it? You really know how to stick the knife in, Bruce. I should have known things were wrong the moment you put that tracker on me. You've been using me from the start! At least have the decency to admit it! The least you can do is come clean about that! I'm not stupid, Bruce! Please, please, don't feed me any more lies. Okay. Maybe I have been using you. I'm sorry, John, but there's more at stake here than your feelings. It's like Dr. Leland always said. I to mean another person's emotions! John? <laughs> I know. You can fight better than that. What do you need your bat suit to really get you in the mood? What? You forget I know you, Bruce. The real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, businessman, criminal. Bat. You can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. John, John, that's ridiculous. I'm the furthest thing from Batman there is. No, <laughs> you don't have to keep your mask on anymore, Bruce. Not with me. <sighs> oh, are you gonna make me trot out all the evidence? All right. How about the vanishing act you pulled at the cafe when the bat signal showed up? You don't think I noticed how obvious that was? You think you can use that against me? As blackmail? Oh, I would never! We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Bound together, even under strain. Then what's your point? After we raided the agency's convoy, Harley stashed one of their trucks here. And now it's gone. Which means she's getting out of town. Across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. I'm not asking for much. Just a little faith. I swear to you, this was self-defense. One more time. You do believe me, don't you? still have faith in me, don't you? Your old buddy, John? This is a mess. And we are gonna need to talk about it more. But... I believe you. Let's get out of here, huh? Before anyone else shows up. Agreed! All these fuzzy emotions are giving me indigestion. We've got to catch up with Harley before these murderous agents find her. She's got explosives and the virus. If they start shooting, things could get really exciting. Oh boy! <laughs> if I had known these were your wheels, I never would have stolen that beater.
I'll blow this bridge to hell if you don't give me Riddler's blood! Can't do it, Quinn. Even if I wanted to. I mean it! The bridge and every sad son of a bitch on it! The blood is gone! The serum you want is no longer an option! Stand down now! No one needs to get hurt! I said get back! They're gonna kill her, Bruce! They're gonna shoot first and ask questions later! I can't just stand here and do nothing! We can't let that happen! We'll keep her safe, John. You don't have to worry. Hearing you say that really calms my nerves. Wayne, about time you showed up. What in the good goddamn is he doing here? Director Waller, John Doe's, uh, been aiding Bruce's investigations. This creature's with you? Amanda Waller, meet John Doe. He's a trusted friend. I'm, uh, I'm here to defuse the situation. I have my doubts, but hell. At this point, I'll try anything. Harley's making demands we simply can't meet. Her detonator's on a dead man's switch. She lets it go. This bridge is history. This situation is rapidly spiraling out of control. I'm running out of options. Harley is heading towards a cliff, and she's gonna drag all of us with her. I can talk her off the ledge. Just give me a moment. She won't listen. All she wants is Riddler's goddamn blood. And that's gone. One of my own people destroyed it. Someone inside the agency. The serum Quinn wanted to make is off the table for good. Let me try. <sighs> Give it a shot, Bruce. See what you can do. Stand down, people. Let him through. <laughs> well, well, well. Bruce Wayne. Harley. Never thought I'd see you again. Thought you'd cut and run after your cover was blown. All I want is Riddler's blood. I get it? I leave Gotham for good. That agency hellbeast says she don't got it, but I know she's lying through her teeth. Her people took it from the lair. The serum you're trying to make, it doesn't do what you think it does. How do you know about that? Because I looked into it. It does as much harm as it does good, maybe more. Harley, you're a doctor. You have to understand. It destroys your brain chemistry. Uh-huh. Sure. You're gonna tell me you love me, Wayne? Excuse me? I like a little romance when I'm getting screwed. I'm holding all the goddamn cards. Either they give me what I want, or I play the one that goes BOOM! I ain't fooling around. I'll do it without a second thought. I know why you're doing this, Harley. If you're afraid of inheriting your father's illness, I can help you find a cure. You don't know me, Wayne. You did. You know better than to bring up my dear old dad. Bruce, what the hell are you doing? Harley does not like talking about such personal things. Stand down! She's gonna lose it! Ah, uh, Puddin? Let me talk to her. I know her better than anyone. I'm so glad you're here, baby! These deadbeats want my head on a stick! You can do it, John. I believe in you. I won't let you down. I have everything worked out. Up here. Trust me. I learned from the best. Okay, just... What? Tell her what she wants to hear. You mean I should ignore what you said in the cafe? About being myself? Whatever it takes to make her give up that detonator. That sounds like a terrible idea, Bruce. Harley will see straight through me if I try anything shady. Hey, don't worry about a thing. 
With all these people watching, how can I not live up to the occasion? Those two reprobates getting their heads together is a recipe for a disaster. Oh, what were you thinking? John said it himself. He knows her better than anyone. As long as he keeps her talking, there's still a chance she won't blow the bridge. There's truth in that. Not enough to inspire confidence, but it's better than nothing. This is going south. We're gonna shut this down right now. If we interfere now, we could push her right back into Harley's arms. If we don't, everyone on this bridge will die. Stand by to move in, people. Alpha team, move into flank. What the hell do you think you're doing? You gotta trust him, Waller. I'm telling you, he'll come through. With a marriage proposal, maybe. Not a successful resolution to the crisis at hand. You need to have faith. Stand down. You... Stabbing piece of crap! Don't struggle, Harley. They think you're a fighter. They're gonna put you in the hole. I'm gonna rip your head off, you two diamond son of a! Get her out of here. How could you, John? You broke my heart. Bruce showed me how to be good, Harley, in a way you never could. Thank you for your help, Mr. Doe. You did a great job. The virus. Please. I don't think so. I don't think anyone should have this. Least of all you. Well then, we'll no longer be requiring your service. No! What are you doing? He helped us! You betrayed me! After I saved the day! <sighs> you agency people! You're just the worst! <laughs> Find that bag and get Quinn in the truck immediately. Where's Wayne? I want him secured. Subdue him if you have to. Good to know you have my back. John? You corrupt pigs. You're supposed to stand for justice. For you liars. And you murderers. And you're so goddamn rude. What the heck? What's wrong with this thing? Come on. Work! Yes! That's what I want to see! Ha 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 ha!